Yo, what's going on guys? It's your boy Eternal Jevy, and in today's video, I'm bringing guys a brand new GTA 5 solo money glitch. Now, the first thing I'd like to say to you guys is that I am streaming on Twitch daily for like three to four hours. So if you guys would like to do me a favor, go ahead and click the first link in the description. It'll take you straight to my Twitch. I'll probably be live now, but if I'm not, just drop a follow, you know, turn those noties on and be active over there. I'd really appreciate it. Also, follow my Twitter link in the description. And yeah, let's go ahead and get straight into this money glitch. So the first thing that you guys do want to do is go ahead and buy a penthouse at the casino. Now, this is a necessary step um, to make the most amount of money. But um, if you guys don't have this amount of money to start off, you guys can go ahead and watch my other video until you guys get to the amount of money needed to buy yourself a nice and cheap penthouse as you guys see i bought mine for pretty cheap only 1.5 mil rockstar has been given out one mil so that already basically paid for then all you guys want to do is go to your accessories and go ahead and change one of them and if you guys look in the bottom right you see that orange circle loading that means that say that like my power was a go out or something it would load right back to where i just was before or actually right after i changed the accessory so now what you want to do is go ahead and place a bet and you want to click uh, triangle I believe it is to place the max and you either want to place it on red or black. It don't matter which one but I'm doing red so I suggest you guys do red as well so you guys can go ahead and follow along easier. If you want to you can even win more money by placing it on a certain number but then the payout would take longer and you guys will see what I mean. So you guys just want to wait for the uh, timer to go down and as this is spinning around you guys will see that it will slowly start to fall in line now if it lands on a red that's good you guys will see what i do but if it doesn't it lands on a black what you guys will want to do is either disconnect from your internet or just close application it doesn't matter which one you do me personally i disconnect from the internet but i really can't show you guys that because i do record off of the uh, playstation and it doesn't let me show those screens so as you guys seen it landing on black but i betted all my chips on red so what i had to do like i just said i disconnected from the internet and now as you guys will see it will go ahead and load me out of gta online and it will load me into the offline mode now once you guys do go ahead and load into offline all you guys want to do is go ahead and click start and go ahead and go to online and then join back into the online session now your settings should be set to where your spawn location is at last location and if it is then of course when you spawn in you will be at the penthouse or the um like right outside the casino this it depends on if you set it there at the penthouse or if you just spawn outside but the reason that you need the penthouse anyways is so you guys can play the high rollers and bet more and in turn win more now the reason that this is a money glitch is because when you lose the chips you're not really losing them so it's like if i bet you five dollars on something and i lost the bet it'd be like me keeping the five dollars but every time i win the bet i'm gaining five dollars and eventually like that would just give me unlimited money so that's basically how this works too but with the chips and uh every single chip can be traded in for a dollar it's a one-to-one -one ratio and as you guys see, I'm editing my spawn location, making sure that's on last location. That's what I'll show you guys. And then uh, you want to go ahead and enter the casino. If you're in the penthouse, of course, then you can go ahead and just go to the casino. But being outside of it, I go ahead and just walk into the casino. Because it's basically the same thing, except uh, you do need it to play high rollers, like I said earlier. Now, there is other methods of this, but this is the best method. Now... All you want to do now is go ahead and just make your way back. It's pretty much that simple. You guys are going to be repeating this process over and over. But make sure to keep watching so that way you know what to do when you do go ahead and win. Also, there's another method that you guys can do at these casino uh, slots right here. And it's basically the same thing as this. When you lose, do the first step that I showed you. And when you win, do the step that I'm about to show you. And you can also do it on the horses. You can bet max on one horse. And then, uh, you know, same exact thing again, lose, disconnect, win, uh, do the step that I'm about to show you. So, as you guys see, I make my way over here right now. It actually took me a lot longer than it should have, but it was because this was 
my first time back on GTA in a while. So I go ahead and walk back over to this table. It doesn't matter which table, just make sure it is something like this. Go ahead and sit down at the roulette. And then you guys will see that I believe I place it all on red again. And now I just have to wait for that 35 second timer in the top right to wind down. So while that is winding down, just wanna say again, please make sure to follow my Twitch and Twitter. Top links in the description. And make sure to subscribe, drop a like and comment for you know youtube algorithm it does help the channel out a lot more than a lot of people actually say it actually helps it out a lot especially when you drop a like and go ahead and comment if this worked or not for you because i want people to actually realize that it does work because i know when i look at a video the first thing i go to is the comments so make sure to comment if this does work for you or not and if it doesn't let me know why it doesn't work for you and i will go ahead and help you and try to see like what's going wrong why it isn't working so right here uh the 40 seconds is now up and it is now landing and as you guys will see it will go ahead and land on red i believe so now all you want to do is and you guys see it says i want a hundred thousand chips so all you want to do is just stand up and then you want to go ahead and change an accessory again because now my max money i'll go back to the five dollar thing now instead of having five bucks to bet every time i now have 10 bucks to bet every time and even if i lose i'll go back to 10 bucks now instead of that five so that is how this is a money glitch but yeah that's going to go ahead and do for this one hope you guys did go on to enjoy it's been your boy jevy and i am out y'all peace